I, I don't. Hey, Lord, I, I, I can't help but notice Coach Rick. He's on you guys, man, about every single little detail when you run routes. You know, you fly. You guys, what, what's that like to have a guy that's so detail oriented? Uh, it's great. Uh, that's what you want in a coach to be on you every single detail because every little detail, especially the competition we play, is going to matter in the, in the, the defensive backs that we play in the ACC and to start the game off in the SEC. So uh, it's great to have a coach like that, and we thank you for it. What's the balance like between competition and camaraderie? Because that wide receiver room is pretty crowded, a lot of talented guys. But how are you guys working that balance between the competition and, and the brotherhood of it all? We're all family. We're all brothers. Uh, we all know that you know you compete for jobs, but at the end of the day, you just you just go out there and have fun. You do what you do, do what you, what you came here to do, what you were recruited here to do. So let the coaches handle that. You just you just go out and do what, do your thing. Do you guys feel the competition on the practice field? Just watching everybody take reps, and I'm sure there's a lot of quality out there. And I mean, yes, but like we don't really focus on that. It's just somebody make a play. We have, we're more happy for somebody else making a play than yourself. Uh, so it's really just a, it's a brotherhood. And that's what Coach, Coach Dugas wants in us, and that's what we got. Coach, how, how glad are you that Coach named, uh, I think, the starter, and you guys don't have to worry about all, all the questions about who's going to be playing quarterback? I mean, what, what does that do outside for, for continuity with you guys? Y'all don't, uh, don't have to ask me what I think about the quarterback, so that's good. Um, but no, it was, it's good. Uh, it's good for confidence-wise for Malik, too, uh, going in the first game. And, you know, we're going to ride with him, and we're going to build on a uh, relationship with the receivers and, and him. Yeah. He's ready to go. We will, however, ask you how he's looked out there the first couple days. Um, you know, one of the things that uh, Amon said back at ACC Media Days was just he's playing with a chip on his shoulder right now. Are you guys seeing that, that he's wanting to prove himself and wanting to, to silence some of those critics? Yeah, I think so. Uh, he wants to He wants to prove that, you know, he is a, he is a good quarterback. He's worthy of the starting quarterback job, and he was given it for a reason, and uh, he wants to build on those last two games as a team, we want to build on the last three games of the season. Uh, so what have you seen from him through the first two days? Uh, more leadership, uh, more consistency, and that's all you can ask for a quarterback. How are the backups coming along? Uh, they're good. Uh, you know, progression, Jaren, Kosey, Kade, they all looking good, progressing from each year to year, from watching them from when they first came in, the spring ball to here, and now it's just, they're getting much better. Yeah, it is, and it's also good because everybody can do everything. Uh, even the big guys can go on the slide and do the slot guys. Slot guys can go outside and do some type of bigger shooters can do. So it's good to have guys and coaches coaching it like that, and that's what he wants. So it's good to have a variety too. So it's great. How would you describe today's practice? Oh, it was good. Good, intense. Uh, coach been stressing compete, and I think we really competed the best since spring. So I think I think today was a great practice. How are you guys handling expectations heading into the opener? Really don't, really don't uh, focus. We know we, you know, with the AP and all that, we know that we're going to be ranked high, but we're, we're not really looking on that. We're focused on how to build off the last three games, how to get better off the last three games if we can finish well. And uh, that's what we're most worried about. What's it been like watching uh, Amon get back to work? I mean, he said yesterday he felt a little gas, but just seeing him and having him back out there, how much does he just add by being a part of the room? Uh, it adds another playmaker to the field. Um, a guy that you can just get the ball in his hands and let him work. Uh, a lot of guys on the field just can do that. So it just adds another playmaker to the field. You know, a guy with his high, high caliber pressure in. Uh, getting back to full health is, is great. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks.